Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. I am going to sign up for this sports kuji, this sports lottery called Club Toto. Toto and Big. It's a different kind of takarakuji. And this is the application to get points. Now, I don't really know how to play this kind of lottery, but I'm sure you want to know. I kind of want to know. And、um, you can get this application at any takarakuji stand. And this envelope came with this. So I want to get this point card. And I'm just going right to. Oh, you can buy lottery tickets 24 hours a day. You can buy this kind of lottery ticket at shops that sell big slash toto or at any Japanese convenience store. Yep, at any Japanese convenience store, at Lawson, Family Mart, or 7 Eleven. Now, I should be careful when I say any. These are the main places. Let's just get to the application. Okay, here is the actual application, and here is a sample application. I have to check this top box because. That looks like the right box. For a few, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, so I'm going to check this box. Okay, and then I'm going to leave this blank. I'll leave it up to the people at Club Toto. Here, I'm going to write my surname, my family name. In their example, it's in kanji. And then above it, it's in furigana, that is katakana. So I'm going to write my family name here, then in katakana, and my given name, my first name, then in katakana. Okay, on to field three my date of birth, the year, the month, and the number. And then in field four, circle if you're a male or female. I'm a male, so. This. Then in field five, my address. Here I will write my postal code. Here I will write my prefecture, then circle this one, that is Ken. Ken means prefecture. Then my city is Kobe. And I will circle this one, that is Shi, which means city. Then Write out my entire address. If you live in an apartment, don't forget to write the number. Then I'm going to write these characters in katakana, leaving out the numbers. Just Hyogo in katakana, Kobe in katakana, and my street address. Okay, that is in katakana, like in the example. In field six, write your telephone number. You can use your cell phone number or your home number. In field seven, you need to copy one piece of ID, either your driver's license, your passport, your Zydeo card, that is your alien registration card, okay,、uh, your Juming Hyo, your student ID with a photo, your Kenko Hoken card, that is your. Health insurance card. I would stick with a driver's license, your Japanese driver's license. Just a copy of the front page. Make sure it's nice and clear. If you're sending a copy of your My Number, they want you to cover the number, just the number, because it's sensitive. So don't send that. And for the email, write in whatever email you use. Here and here. This is PC and this is K Tai, that is your cell phone. I would use the same for each. Okay, so going back to field seven, I am going to copy my driver's license, so it would be this one. I would check this box and then copy my license and then include it with this application. That's it. Okay, don't check these boxes. Okay, and don't forget to write the date at the top. So、um, it is 2021. It is February and this is 
All right, I'm going to do this and that's how to fill out this application. I'm going to copy my license. I'm going to fill out this form and then I'm going to put this in this envelope. And one more thing, and on this self-addressed envelope, you do not need a stamp. It tells you the validity of this particular stamp. Well, that's printed on this. Mine says, unto Rewa 3, August 31. So August 31, 2021. So if you're interested in getting a point card, this is the way to do it. Thanks for watching, guys. Good luck. Bye.